Hey, we got a groaner for you. I didn't think that a chiropractor would improve my posture, but I stand corrected. I wrote this down. It's profound from your wiser advisor. Here it comes. Reason and good sense and human nature and history show us that the right to defend yourself is a natural instinct. That's an extension of the right to self-preservation, which is, of course, the right to live. One has a duty to use your freedom to preserve life. Pretty cool. Pretty accurate. Governments do not have that right to take your right away to defend your own life or those of your loved ones. A propaganda war to people who obey the law is a tool for governments so intent on warring against the ones that they actually work for. Bad laws must not be obeyed. Martin Luther King said that. Hey, go buy a gun. Americans, Canadians, get on it. And so the man said, I've moved on now, stick with me. And so the man said, I'm not a racist, I hate everyone. <laughs> Just say in Jason Kenney. He's the guy that wants to be Premier of Alberta. That would be in Canada. And he sent out his Christmas message here several weeks ago now, of course, by video. And he said it was a powerful Christmas story. And I watched it. And, and I got to tell you, it was disappointing. Alberta is in a slump uh, with the oil and the economy, and, and they have a socialist government presently, and Conservative Party, Doc Conservative Party, Bills Kennedy as being their savior, right? And his whole message was about bringing in immigrants when he was in charge of immigration on the federal scene, on the federal level. And not once that I heard, at least, did he talk about Alberta. We have oil, we have this, and we have you know, blah, blah, blah. All he talked about was 20 immigrants from Iraq that he brought in and, and the taxpayer got to support. Uh, that was disjointed. He kind of lost me on that one. A bank lends you an umbrella when the weather is great, and when it rains, they ask for it back. <laughs> kind of sounds like a lot of people we know. Government, banks, we need a new bank act in the U.S., we need a new bank act in Canada. Probably many other countries also need a bank act. You've got to be competitive. It's not competitive in Canada, where I happen to be as I'm doing this particular show. It's awful. I mean, they're all the same. I, I mean, we'll give you money if you don't eat it. I already said that once with the umbrella. Y'all come back tomorrow. See ya.